Welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, I will be showing you how you can create pneumorphic design in your Flutter application. Pneumorphic design is a visual trend that has gained traction with UI designers and become a popular aesthetic choice for building websites and mobile apps. This is because pneumorphism brings stimulated physical attributes such as shadows and texture to digital interfaces. Now I will show you in Flutter code. So here I have created a simple Flutter application that has only a scaffold with background color set and an app bar. Next, in the scaffold body, I will create a button that applies pneumorphism. This solution is created completely from scratch without using any packages, which you have maximum capabilities for customization. For the content of the button, I will add a search icon. Container widgets in Flutter by default is in rectangle shape. For a better UI view, we will apply a circular border radius to the container. Next, we will be adding box shadow. Box shadow is the key to apply pneumorphism. As we mentioned in the beginning of the video, pneumorphism is about shadows and texture. Pneumorphism uses shadow to create an elevation effect. Two opposite edges of the container are considered, one in front of the source of light while another opposite. So the first box shadow we will set the offset to both tanned value. Next, we have to duplicate the same box shadow but with different color and offset position. Due to the first box shadow offset value are both 10, for the second box shadow, it have to be negative 10 to apply the opposite effect. Now let's hot restart the Flutter application and see how it looks. Let me move the button to center. And this is how pneumorphism UI element looks in Flutter. Now let's create a few more pneumorphic widgets. Since we have built the UI elements, I will just replicate the same container and change the child icon. And this is how you apply pneumorphism in your Flutter UI element. Here comes to the end of the tutorial. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next tutorial.